Warren Buffett said, It takes 20 years to build a reputation and 5 minutes to ruin it. What's a real life example of this? Gerald Ratner. At one time, Ratners were a nationwide chain of jewelry shops in the UK. They were known as an affordable jewelry shop. In 1991 he was a guest at the Institute of Directors and made a speech where he called the stuff sold by his shops total crap. A popular range of earrings was described as being cheaper than a prawn sandwich and compounded it by saying the prawn sandwich would last longer. Shares in the company dropped like a stone and he was fired by the majority company shareholders. There was a PC building company earlier this year that disqualified a prize winner because the company owner thought the winner's social media presence was too weak. Not fake. Mind you. Just not popular enough to be worth sponsoring. The most popular girl at my school farted in the bathroom. So loud. It lasted as a discussion topic for weeks. The, I have a scream, speech. HTTPS. www.history.com slash this dash day dash in dash history slash the dash dean dash scream. HTTPS www.history.com slash this dash day dash in dash history slash the dash dean dash scream https www.youtube.com slash watch v equals l6 i g y r a w m 0 https www.youtube.com slash watch V equals L6 I G Y R A W M 0. Michael Richards who played Kramer is Seinfeld. Ruined his images literally in a five minutes when he lost his cool and went on a racist rant. The PR chick traveling to South Africa who tweeted something like. Heading to Africa. Hope I don't get AIDS. Just kidding. I'm white. Quote. Turned her phone off for the flight. And by the time she turned it on when she landed. It had gone viral and. If memory serves. She had already lost her job. Rudy G could have retired as America's mayor. Instead his obituary will have a picture of his makeup dripping during a press conference at a. Landscape parking lot. Will Smith. Martin Shrelly. Hedge fund manager. Pharmaceutical CEO. Daraprim. Over the course of a night. Elon Musk tweeting out that the rescue diver for the Thai cave rescue was a pedophile. To me that was the start of his weird bad publicity. Bill Cosby comes to mind. CEO of Robinhood. Michael Richards from Seinfeld. In 2006. A video was published of him going on a racist tirade against hecklers while performing at the Laugh Factory. His career never recovered. Will Smith. The Coney 2012 viral campaign came to an abrupt halt when one of the main people was caught on camera walking around on a public street masturbating. Oscar Pistorius. Keep my wife's name out of your fucking mouth. Have you heard of Facebook? O.J. Simpson. James Franco. Kevin Spacey. I have no idea whether he actually did it. But either way. It definitely didn't take long for his reputation to be ruined. CDPR. Put out some of the best. Most well-regarded games for an entire generation. Then mismanaged and rushed cyberpunk out the door. And they're no longer the company that made The Witcher. Now they're the company that fucked up cyberpunk. Super Bowl 51 for the Atlanta Falcons. Will Smith. Zinedine Zidane at FIFA World Cup Finals. Don't be silly. That's being silly. Bear Stearns is fine. Quote. Although to be fair. He's always been a skeevy little piece of shit. Will Smith. Gerald Ratner, British businessman who talked down his jewellery company's products at some event.
their high street chain Ratners disappeared. Will Smith. Will Smith. Bill Cosby. Well. I had been very successful at my work until I jumped up on a table at the Christmas party and whipped out my cock and yelled, suck my cock. Quote. Things changed after that. Zdane's headbutt. Jimmy Savile and Gary Glitter. Amber Heard. Multiple. You've got Will Smith. Amber Heard. Any Twitter user and more LMFAO. Penn State Football. Joe Biden. Prince Andrew. Mel Gibson. China. Russia. What little positive reputation they had. What little hope there was pumping them full of trade and money would convert them. Elon Musk. Activision Blizzard. EDP 445. I had this one band called Part Time on repeat a few years ago. They were pretty good. One day I noticed Spotify pulled their entire catalog off the app and I think their record label dropped him as well. Turns out the front man is kind of a creep. I forgot the details exactly. It was a while ago. Haven't heard much from them since then. B20. Have some girl falsely accuse you of a assault. No matter the evidence, the stigma stays. Amber heard. It didn't take five minutes, but she's achieved infamy all the same. Bill Cosby. From being known as a beloved TV show icon to being known as a full-on rapist. 